Hi, this is Dex, and I've got another talk about therapeutic spiritual counseling. The subject of this talk is relationships and the resolving and processing thereof. Specifically, what I call personality image projections. When we talk about relating to each other, what does that mean? How do we do that? Well, this is very interesting, but this is how, this is what we mean by relating. I present to you two personality image projections. A personality image projection is three-dimensional, holographic. It, it's a moving, life-size image that contains everything that you would think of as being an aspect of a person. Behavior patterns, attitudes, mannerisms, uh, a physical appearance. Uh, ways of reacting to things, specific purposes, uh, specific type of games that the person plays. So when one person relates to another person, there are two images cast to be perceived and accepted by the other person. So from me to you, there is the personality image projection of this is who you are to recognize me as being. There's a three-dimensional holographic, uh, fully rich uh, of aspects and, and uh, conditions and qualities, uh, and that is me. That is who you are to regard me as being. It's a three-dimensional holographic projection that is received by you, uh, projected to you from me. Then there is the other projection from me to you, which is, this is who you are to me. And there are certain aspects of qualities and characteristics and physical appearance and behavior patterns and ways of communicating and goals and purposes and uh, mannerisms and everything that identifies a specific person as being a specific person. So I am imposing uh, all the time, two projections to you. This is who I am to you, and this is who you are to me. And you're doing the same thing. You're presenting yourself and sending me a projection of how you are to be regarded and what you are to be regarded as. And then you're also projecting on me who I am to you. And this is all... Uh, a not fully conscious uh, activity, obviously, but it's always going on. And it fixes people in undesirable conditions in trying to be or trying not to be or resisting or feeling imposed on us a, a, a beingness, a personality, and all the qualities thereof. And this has a very dramatically uh, harmful effect over time on relationships. And so these need to be resolved. But that is what relating is. It's a casting of personality image projections. Uh, this is who I am to you. This is who you are to me. And those coming across in two directions. So there's a total of four personality image projections between any two people relating to each other, whether it's one-time meeting or continuously. We're more concerned about ongoing relationships, obviously. The more frequent, the more common, the closer, uh, the more severe the impact of these projections are. And I have something I do called uh, relationship processing to resolve the differences between people so they can have a better relationship. And there are three procedural steps, one of which is resolving personality image projections, thus freeing people to be who they are with other people to be able to change, uh, to not be fixed, to not uh, turn into something when relating to a specific person. And this is something, if you think about it, happens to us. We're one person when we encounter this individual, and we're another person when we encounter that individual. Right there. That's the effect of personality image projections. So these things can be resolved. They can be undone. So you can be, as they say, comfortable in your own skin. 
and not feel a need to shift into a personality when encountering a specific other person or to impose things on the other person that cause them to do the same. Uh, part of resolving this is taking a look at uh, what about this attracted you, you know, what, what your purpose has been in playing this game, in being this personality, accepting these projections from the other person. Because you have your own purpose for doing that, or else you would never have it hung on you. So there's a factor of what you're desiring, what you're attracted to, and what you're creating in what you experience, as well as for the other person. So these are some of the factors that get looked at in resolving personality image projections. And this is done, it's very freeing, and we all feel much more comfortable with each other without having to see a person a certain way or having to fit a mold that we sort of unconsciously click into with this person or the mold we click into with that person. And we can just be. Relationships are much better without these projections being held in place. Quite relieving. I'll just leave you with that for today. If you'd like to know more, contact me. Now this is Dex saying, always have fun. <laughs>